Hello everyone. Uh, welcome back to Transport Fever 2 Tropical Fun. Now we're sitting around here at Killeen uh, where we were last time uh, messing about with farm connections and I'm going to bring in the uh, iron ore connection here uh, and that's going to uh, uh, that's going to come in around I'm going to bring it around here and then join up with the track here so I can come into these platforms here and uh, I'm also going to bring the uh, food here the connection for the food processing plant in around through there as well uh, and that's just because we have all this traffic here like all this you know, stuff in the way here so so I'm going to do that so the first thing I'm going to do is get this uh, this here road out of the way Uh, right, get it out of the way, all the way back to there. Get that one out of the way too. Uh, right, so I'm going to need to put a platform here. I can see in this case we might need to uh, put longer trains uh, to avoid uh, complications with... Uh, um, having too many trains on the line but first of all we need to get across this here oh I left a piece of road there that's the problem uh, right uh, okay so we need to get first we need to get across this here uh, thing and we'll make sure that goes out level right now we need to crank it around into here Um, yeah, don't force that to be level. Um, now what I you know what I need to do. Uh, the first thing I need to do is pause this and rejigger this because it's bothering me. Um, does that actually go down or is it level? It's level to there. Then it goes down. Ah, right. Okay. Well, take this out. Take this out. Take this out. Back to. Um, yeah, we need to come back to about here. Okay. Now. No, you come out like this. Will that work? Yeah, I think that does. Now, is that level ish? It is. Okay, so that's going to bug me a lot less. Uh, right. Bring this around. Good. Now put back the signals. Yeah, uh, I, I should. Okay. So you put back the signals. Now let the trains uh, move again. Okay, so yeah, that did have a big dip in there. Uh... Yeah, uh, that's definitely better. Now, uh, what you need to do is get a couple of tracks around from there. Uh, I think I can get two more tracks across that, so I'm going to try that. But I'll put in a uh, starter here. Now, if we go level, yeah, I think level... I'm going to try level. Uh, right. Because that may avoid some issues if we can uh, just chuck a tunnel in there. Maybe we can't. Okay. But we can definitely go level. Like this. Come through here. 
It doesn't matter which side we come through on there. Okay, yeah, I think that'll work. It'll look nasty, but I think it'll work. Uh, right. Okay, yeah, I think that'll work. So we'll go with it. Uh, yeah, there's that. Now, can you actually get four tracks across here? Well, I'm going to try. Well, there's a third track. Ah, we can. Now, well, that's the maximum we can get across there. Okay. Well, that's acceptable. Uh, and this means that we can avoid messing with the other uh, lines. Now, did that mess this up at all? Just barely not. Okay. Well. I wonder if we have enough tracks coming in over here. Well, this is going to have to come in this way. And like this. And this is going to have to... Uh, oh, come on. Really? Well, we'll bring this across this way. Yeah. And then... We'll do this. Yeah. And just for uh, giggles, I'll do this. Right? Uh, yeah. Okay, so now you need to slip that one. Good. That's got the uh, tracks coming in there. Uh, and that means we've also got a way into that track across here. So we can get in across here. Yeah, okay. So that's uh, that will work. Right. Well, you, you're you going to need a signal or two on that. Yeah, I rather suspected I might. You know, you're probably putting more signals in. You, you, you say that every time. Yeah, I guess it is kind of redundant, isn't it? Yeah, just a little bit. Now... Of course, we're going to have a few trains running on here, at least three. So, actually having a stack of signals along here might not be such an unreasonable thing to do. Uh, yeah, it might not be. Uh, anyway, good. Uh, now, this is uh, killing iron ore mine. So, iron ore mine and so is this one iron ore mine yes good uh, you should fling a train at that I probably should uh, right and then you should fling a train or, or, or tracks up to the um, farm. Yeah, I should probably do that first, actually, so I can build the junction here. Okay, so we're coming through flat here. Uh, so I'll uh, build the uh, junction on the flat here. So make sure that's flat. Make sure that's going. Now, we can... I should be able to just bring this... What? Uh, bring this across here. Like that. And like that. Yeah, that'll work. Okay, we have a junction. 
Okay. So I've got the junction. Uh, I need to put a station here. And this is going to need two platforms. Two, huh? Well, yeah, we got the drop-off platform and the pickup platform. Well, you know, you don't actually need to have two platforms for that. You won't have a conflict. Yeah, but, you know, we can afford a platform. So let's put a platform. Oh, is that how this is going? Yeah, that's how this is going. Right, okay. And you just electrified your stations again, you moron. Yeah, yeah, I just saw that. Yeah, I know you just saw that. I'm you, aren't I? Really? Are you? Now oh, stop being incredulous. Yeah, I suppose I could do that. But you're not going to, are you? Well, well, it does take effort, so maybe I will. It takes effort to stop or effort to, uh, to continue. Well, you know what I mean. It takes effort to continue. Ah, I see. Right. Okay. Now, uh, I really wish they'd fix this bug. Because it's really, really, really annoying. Uh, right. So we do this. And then we do this. Okay, that one worked. Now we uh, fling a, a signal on here. That's more than one. Yeah, you know what I meant. What did you mean then? You're going to fling a signal at the end there. Oh, I see. Uh, and of course you're not you're, you you were going to say something stupid with that too, weren't you? No. Whatever gave you that idea? Well, you know, you were thinking about a blind man and canes. Was I? Yes, yes you were, and you know it. Why don't you just say it? Okay, then. I see, said the blind man, and picked up his cane and walked away. You made a hash of that. Yeah, I probably did. Okay, that takes the uh, electric out of there, and the electric out of there. Now, this is the Killeen Food Processing Plant. Yep. Uh, and this one is also going to be Food Processing Plant. Yep. Uh, right. Okay, now you need to uh, fling some trains on this. Yeah, it rather looks like I do. Okay. Well, you've got your uh, your thing there. My thing? Yeah, your thing. Uh, now, we're, we're still doing locos. Yeah, we'll still use the Mikado. Uh, right. Uh, cargo, we need gondolas. One, two, three, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We're going to need two trains with gondolas. And we're going to need a train with boxcars. Twelve. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And this is going to be uh, needing a loco. Yep. Buy it. Okay. Now, new line uh, from here to here. Well, that appears to work. Uh, so that's Killeen Iron Mine to Killeen Hub. Okay. 
Now, the uh, the kernel um, suggested in his uh, recent uh, video, uh, let's uh, let's ride this one. That uh, building a hub network was actually uh, kind of lazy. Now, he does have a point, uh, but as you can see from this setup, uh, it's not necessarily as uh, easy as it looks uh, on a 10,000 foot overview. Now, I do have a reason for doing it this way on this map. It's just the way the industries are all spread out. Uh, and plus, it gave me a, uh, a plan of attack, so to speak, uh, for uh, doing things. Uh, and that, uh, you know, it's, it's different than what I would have done uh, normally. Uh, well, you saw what I was doing normally uh, earlier in the series, right? Uh, where I was uh, going ahead and making point-to-point -point connections and all of that. Uh, and uh, as you can see, the existing point-to-point -point connection uh, in around Killeen there has been a little bit of an obstacle for doing this. Oh, look, we got two trains oncoming here. Okay, so we got a passenger train and a tanker train. And apparently a blocked track ahead. Ah, it's the train from the farm, I think. Because we have to go across that platform, right? And that train is pulling out. Uh, we can see the train going over to the other farm up there. Yeah, so this is the reason I, I one of the reasons I want to do the hub thing because it's a great way to get a, a whacking huge collection of uh, trains going in and out of a place. Okay, that train should be just about clear. At which point we should start to move. Come on. There we go. We're moving. I'm actually holding off on uh, connecting anything up with trucks until we get up to like the 1950s or whatever when we get the uh, Peterbilts, the, the, the semi-trucks. Um, but, you know, for now. Uh, okay. Now, what's it going to do here? Uh, which track is it going to pick? Yeah, I thought it might do that. Right. So now we go all the way through the massive station here. Uh, which will give us a pretty good flat run up for uh, gaining speed. I really want to see how this uh, massive uh, viaduct, uh, four-track viaduct thing is doing here. Okay, so we come out. I got this reasonably well lined up, so that's okay. I was going for a little bit straighter than that, but that's fine. Right. So we have this massive... Um, Okay, so it goes down to the station for the passengers there. Then we go over the station building here. What's that thing sticking up in the track there? That's the station building, isn't it? Yeah, that's the top of the station building. Uh, I should probably go and replace that with a smaller building. Okay. Might want to rebuild the passenger uh, platform exit there too, so it's uh, a little less uh, um, ugly. Okay, come through this uh, cut here. Um, well, this cut looks like it's deep enough that I can just use it to bridge uh, as a, or, you know, to bridge over the tracks uh, with a road. So 
so that split works works well and then our uh, track across the narrow here the isthmus isthmus that's a hard word uh, isthmus isthmus yeah it's um, let's not use it the narrow bit of land Okay, so that that works. Okay, now let's go back to the uh, depot, and we'll grab uh, the other, uh, and then we'll do a new line, and this is going to go from here to here, and that's going to be uh cargo rail killing food plant to killing hub gondola right because that was the gondola train right um yeah that is the gondola train and then we'll go in here and we'll add a new line for this one which will Go here to here, and that's going to be Killeen Food P, Killeen Hub, Boxcar. Right. Now, uh, yeah, I'll uh, grab the Boxcar one, and uh, we'll ride this. Uh, let's up-tempo this until we get to the uh, hub. Because, uh, you know, this part of the track is not terribly exciting. And we're going to have to wait here. There we go. Uh, right. Ah, right, yeah. We need to get on the correct uh, platform here. Now, let's down-tempo this. Right. You know, I think this is uh, coming out quite nice. Uh, I'll end up uh, probably doing a little bit of faffing about with... Um, uh, with uh, the Killeen town itself. Uh, once I've got all of the stuff laid in here, nah, I probably won't. Uh, but uh, overall, uh, this is going to be a, a nice uh, collection of trains moving all over the place here. Okay, now we're heading for the food plant. Um, yeah, I kind of like how this turned out here. Then I just need to um, uh, yeah, I, I I really do need to fix the passenger approach on the other side there. Uh, maybe I'll do that right before I end the part, uh, just to uh, make that a little less hinky. But it's definitely better on the main line that it doesn't have to uh, drop down and back up again. But yeah, that definitely looks way better. Right. Now we're coming around here, through the cut. Now we'll 
will bear right here. And there we can see the town. Um, yeah, I'll uh, end up messing about a little bit here so we can get uh, roads over the tracks. Yeah, just so the town can get on the coast side there. Okay. And that was the food train going back the other way, wasn't it? Or the uh, grain train. Right. Uh... Oh, we got that nice uh, mountain there. Uh, I actually kind of like this map. It, it, it looks kind of nice. Uh, you know, with the, uh, the mountains and everything around. And here we go. Into the station. Yeah, so all of this is going to work. I'm just going to up-tempo here and we'll ride the train back. I just want to see what the scenery looks like going this direction. So we've got the town on the left. Yeah, I think it was definitely the right choice to uh, to move the uh, to bring this bit in around this side. Oh yeah, I think I can probably uh, clobber that bit of embankment there. Okay, we come around here. Good. Okay. Uh, that's all. Uh, that's all good. Uh, that can uh, go away now. Uh, let's go and look over here at what we can do. And it's really this bit here. Actually, that's not that bad. Uh, if we come up here. Um, yeah. Yeah, that's not that bad. We have the road here that, uh, and the uh, junction here that needs to be uh, kept sane. Uh, well, I'm going to down-tempo that, pause that. I'm actually going to uh, see if uh, this can be uh, improved just a little bit. Um, yeah, from there. Uh, okay, so... Uh, I need a track. Yep. That's a track. Now, if I come down this... Oh, right. I have to remove that. And that. Yeah, okay. That should be fine now. Uh, so, if I come down from here and connect up on here... Does it still do the same? That's actually a little bit better. Yeah, I think that's better. Yeah, that's better. Uh, okay, we'll do that. No. Uh, bring it from here. Yeah. Okay, that's definitely better. It's a little uh, smoother. Okay. Yeah, that's definitely better. Okay, uh, put the signals back. Yeah, I should put the signals back. Oh, you need to, f to put this thing back too. Yeah, yeah, I do. Uh, right, okay, so you put the signal back here. And uh, another signal here. Uh, yeah, okay, that should be good. Out of curiosity, uh, paint tools. What can I uh, paint with here? Um,
Grass cut it. What's this actually? Uh, we'll uh, shrink the size. What's that actually look like? Yeah. You know, this isn't, uh, that isn't half bad. I haven't uh, played with these uh, tools uh, before. But, yeah, I could see the appeal of doing this sort of thing. Um, right. Well, if you make the brush size bigger... Yeah. Yeah, maybe not so much. Um, yeah, you don't really want that in between the tracks there. Right. So I can see the appeal of that, um, but yeah, I'm going to not do that. I just haven't played with those before, so yeah, so uh, I could see uh, a brick uh, tiling there or something could uh, could work well for a, a uh, steep uh, uh, viaduct. Right. Well, let's. Uh, get the uh, thing moving again you know we're up to we have 260 million in the uh, in the bank here so yeah there's there's no need to uh, play careful with uh, what we build but uh, yeah that definitely looks better with the relayed track um, yeah so this here uh, we can see uh, we've got uh, trains uh, coming and going here and cargo building up uh, yeah yeah I kind of like it yeah okay uh, well anyway uh, that's uh, going to be where I leave it off for this part here uh, the uh, next part will be up the usual time uh, next week on uh, Monday and uh, I guess, uh, you know, stay healthy um, and the, uh, uh, you know, uh, you know, don't don't be letting the apocalypse get you down too much. You know, uh, at least around these parts, the apocalypse is easing slightly uh, for the moment. But, you know, it, it's still going. And I guess uh, see you back next time.